What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Uh, this video here, I'm going to share with you guys uh, my uh, collection items I got signed up at the uh, Vintage Toy Store in Ocala, Florida uh, just this past uh, Saturday. Um, it was uh, a last minute decision. Uh, you know, about a little over a week ago, I uh, you know, texted one of my buddies, or both my buddies actually, and I said, hey, uh, you know, they got an event going up at uh, Ocala, which is about three hours from now. And, uh, you know, Sergeant Slaughter, Hacksaw Jim Duggan, Medusa, and many others were going to be there as well. So, you know, I asked them if they want to do it, and uh, one of them decided to go with me. So we took a ride up there. And uh, I will tell you guys, it's probably one of my favorite trips uh, that I, I took up there. Um, had a lot of great moments. We were only there for like an hour and a half, uh, but still, it was such a great time. They had. Uh, a really good special going on the entire day where you buy um, anything the store was half off so um, I was supposed to spend like you know hundred eighty dollars for autographs end up spending I think like a hundred maybe a hundred and ten just a rough idea um, but anyways I had a really good time there guys so I figure I show a video here of the items I got signed up at the event here so uh, let's start with uh, the first one here, which is uh, Medusa, Lundra Blaze, um, you know, one of the great female legends back in wrestling. Uh, she was Medusa in WCW and, of course, the Lundra Blaze in WWF. Um, Medusa is awesome. Um, I've met her, I think this was the fourth time I've met her. Um, I've met her at... WrestleCon, met her in Charlotte, North Carolina, and Miami, Florida, and uh, uh, she's such a cool person, very inspirational person, and um, yeah, she was up there, so I wanted to get something signed by her. Um, I did get the uh, that ring bell, which I've shown a video of you guys that before. Um, I had her sign uh, the ring bell there, but uh, when I saw this on Amazon, I thought uh, this would be a cool idea to go get, um, you know, signed by her. So I took that up there, and she already had probably about a half a dozen of these books on her uh, autograph table. But uh, she was really excited that uh, I bought her book and brought it there to get signed. Um, if you guys are, you know, if you love reading, um, you know, stories about the wrestlers and their, you know, Backstory, I guess, basically. Um, I'd certainly recommend this book. This is a very um, inspirational book, and you can learn about her uh, a lot. All right, so let's open the book here. Again, here's the front cover. Um, like I said, you can see it on Amazon.com. Uh, so we open it up here, and she signed right here. Let me get forward here. And she puts to me, thanks for your support, Medusa Lunger Blades, and of course, the year that she signed the book. So, thank you again, Medusa, for signing that. Um, I'm sure I'll read this book again. It's a very uh, inspirational book, as I said. All right, the next one, guys, is Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Now, originally, I was going to have him sign a figure. I ordered that... Um, it's a RetroFest, um, like, arcade action figure. I got it for a good deal on eBay, and it said it was going to arrive before I went up to the trip, and unfortunately it did not. So um, it did come in the mail the other day, so I'm going to have to save it for another time for Hacksaw to sign. But I brought this just in case I didn't have any to sign for him, but uh, this is the Royal Rumble Complete Anthology, the, the first uh, volume. Um, as you guys know, Hacksaw Jim Duggan was the very first ever Royal Rumble winner. So I had him sign this, and he really liked this too. He said he hadn't seen this yet. So, um, yeah, he really liked the idea of having it, uh, the white sign on it. It came out really nice. So, yeah, he put there, um, you know, his name up there, and then Hall of Fame 2011, of course, the first winner. Um, and Hacksaw is not just one of my favorite wrestlers, but certainly one of my favorite, uh, people to meet guys if you haven't met him he's just an awesome awesome guy to meet 
All right, and then one of my, uh, pretty much the one person I was looking forward to seeing um, at the event is the legendary Sergeant Slaughter. Um, I had him, I brought two figures, action figure and the pop figure. Uh, we'll start with the action figure here. I had him signed in the light green military. And uh, I put the markers down on both of these figures for him to use and sign. And you know, he really liked the idea of the light green with the military. And he's like, oh, I think this is going to pop out good. So he, he puts um, at ease. And then he, I don't know if he put just at ease or at ease, Stephen. And then he held the figure out. And he's like, oh, boy, that's going to pop out really good. And it really came out really nice. He did a really great job with that. Um, so, yeah, that's the, what is that, series number 89. I bought this at a Walmart. Um, it was just out of the gloom there. I was like, you know what, let me get that. I like Sergeant Slard's autograph. And finally, guys, um, I did get that the G.I. Joe pop figure signed by Sergeant Slaughter as well. Um, you know, this was something, What this is one of my... Um, you know, one of the items I really wanted to get signed by him, um, and I was really excited to go out, you know, bring this to him. And uh, I brought the colors out, and uh, he, he already had the red, white, and blue colors ready to go. But he said, "Oh, it's cool. You brought the colors. I'll have, you know, I'll sign it for you." Uh, but he he signs all these guys in red, white, and blue. Um, but he really puts in good uh, uh, in detail the way he does this. You know, he puts Yo Joe. There's my name there, uh, Lookout Cobra, Sergeant Slaughter, and then he puts a red, white, and blue star there. So, really cool. Um, really glad I got this sign. And like I said, it was a really fun time, guys. I had a great time on the trip. Uh, my buddy did as well. Um, they said they're going to do another event sometime in, I think it's six months. So, I'm guessing it's going to be summertime. So... Anyways, guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, please do leave your uh, comments below, and I will certainly get back to you. And don't forget to hit that uh, subscribe button. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys next time.